Hello friends, I'm Shweta and welcome to Shweta's Easy Cooking Channel. Today we'll be making aloo bhujia. So, let's see the ingredients. Here I've taken 4 potatoes. I have boiled them and peeled them. This is half cup of besan or chickpea flour, salt, hing or asafoetida, black pepper, chaat masala, and turmeric powder or haldi. First, we'll grate all these potatoes so that we get a lump free dough. I have grated all the potatoes now. Let's start adding all the spices. In goes salt, asafoetida or hing, turmeric powder, chaat masala and black pepper and now we'll add the basin and we'll form a dough the dough has been formed the consistency of the dough should be that of a puri dough the amount of basin which we use depends on the type of potato we are using to this mixture i had to add one more cup of basin as the potatoes which i have used were a little more soft and moist See this is the mold with which we will be making our bhujia and I will be using this sieve with the finest hole to make our bhujia. Let's load the mold. I have greased my mold already. To load the mold we will take some of the dough and make a cylindrical shape out of it. See just like this and then we will fill it up. Now let's close the lid and start making our bhujia. To a wok I have added oil and switched on the flame at medium. The oil is mediumly hot. Now we'll start making our save. We will keep rotating our mold throughout the kadai so that these save don't stick to each other. See just like this. When our kadai will get filled, this is how we will cut our save and put it in the kadai. These are really thin saves so they will be fried in no time and we have to keep our flame at medium during the whole procedure. They are done from one side. Now we will flip them over. We will fry them for 1-2 to two minutes more. They are done now. Let's take them out on a plate. We will continue making our save till the dough is over. These save turn out to be really tasty and really crunchy. They are better than the market brought as they don't have any preservative in it. Enjoy these aloo bhujia with your evening tea, coffee or just fruity. So enjoy.